Why did God injure Jacob's hip? Okay, so as a general rule, I don't answer questions from other platforms, but oh, this was such a great question I had to. Jacob had always run away from his problems. And even here, he's about to face his brother Esau many years after cheating him out of his birthright. He sent his livestock on ahead, he sent his servants on ahead, he sent his kids on ahead, he sent his wives on ahead. That way, if Esau killed a bunch of people, he'd have time to get away. <laughs> but before he actually meets Esau, we get this story of Jacob wrestling with God. Why is this even right here? And it's because of the point that God is going to make. So they end up wrestling. Jacob subdues him because God allowed him to. <laughs> and then the sun's about to come up and God says, hey, let me go. The sun's about to come up. And Jacob says, not until you bless me. God touches his hip, puts it out of joint. And forever after that, Jacob has an injured hip. Now, some people might say, well, that's a cheap shot, God. Couldn't you get out of that? <laughs> yeah, he could. That's not the point. God is saying that if you want my blessing, stop running away from your problems. Have faith that I'm going to take care of you. And we see that that message gets home to him because immediately after this, he actually talks to Esau and there's peace amongst the brothers.